Here we are. Oh, are we crooked? There you go. Um, <laughs> who's shaving for you and has two thumbs? This guy. Um, Super Bowl Sunday. Um, <clears throat> on our last Drinks and Dave show, I think it was P-Beat asking if we were going to do a Super Bowl shave. And I kind of thought, well, I've never... I mean, there's very few circumstances I do a specialty shave. I mean, really, it's just Christmas, right? You have to do Christmas Eve soap on Christmas Day, and then I have Santa's pipe that I use on Christmas Day. Other than that, <clears throat> it's whatevs. Uh, but it got me thinking, if you were if you were prepping for the Super Bowl, if you were going to play in the game, what shave would you do? So first of all, obviously the Super Bowl is a big, huge money machine, right? So everything is sponsored, whatever. So the first thing you do is you'd be wearing your sponsor while you're doing your shave. Uh, no doubt, no doubt. Um, after that, it's all serious business, right? I mean, this is the biggest game of their, maybe their career, certainly the year. So it's all about performance, right? So the first thing is you're going to be wearing this helmet. It's going to be rubbing up against you and you're going to be sweating and stuff. So you're not going to want any irritation. So I wouldn't use a open blade razor. I use the Rockwell 6S, which gives me the smoothest, easiest, least irritation shave in the world. Uh, so I'm all, I'm all set for the game. I'm not going to be, not going to have any razor burn. No little raw spots, no little nicks or whatever. Not accidentally cutting a skin flap because I was so distracted by the big game coming up, right? But then what soap would you use? I use the same logic. Obviously, you're going to want a high-performing soap because that goes to your overall shave. See, look how easy. Look, look at that. Look at that. I got, I got a game to prep for. We don't have time to spend half an hour shaving. This is, this is what we're doing. This is, this is a professional level at its highest, right? So obviously, you're again, you're stuck inside this helmet. You're going to want something that gives you enjoyment, right, for the rest of the game. You're going to want a scent that's going to fill your helmet. And either just get you just all jacked up and ready to go, or uh, you can just take a take a big whiff and be like, "This is where I am. This is where it's at." And what soap are you going to use for that? Obviously, Drinks and Dave's by CBL Soaps. You're gonna you're gonna have this beautiful smelling soap filling your helmet. Right, you're gonna be. You're gonna be sitting there uh, when the when the other side is on the field. You're just you're just kind of thinking about how you've been doing, what's coming up next, the outcome, and you're gonna be you're gonna be smelling this, and it's gonna it's gonna center you, right? It's gonna take you you're in your own little world, right? Just kind of a little bit of zen. To, to, to keep you focused on what's important. Plus, who's gonna, not going to want to smell like, you know, Isla Scotch and leather? I mean, this is manly man stuff. So this, I think, you know, if we, if we asked everybody, you know, what soap, what, what shave would you have picked? They probably wouldn't have come up with this. But now that I mention it, I bet everybody's like, you're right. You're so right, Dave. I know. And look at it. We're almost done. What are we like? Like seven? I okay, can't. Four minutes in. You, you know. So I need an optometrist. I need that. Uh, you know, they got the shields. <laughs> Can do they sell those like prescription strength? Or those shields that go on their helmets. Yeah. I keep forgetting to use it. I think Dave does too. We keep. We were gonna every Tuesday when we have our drinks and Dave show, we were gonna use our soap and it's just the weeks go by quick, man. But uh, it's still a winter, it's awesome. Not just the scent, 
Put the seed build there. Boom. Boom. I'm almost ready for the field is how it is. It's big game day, not just Super Bowl. The Shaving Cadre Super Bowl bingo is today. This one's a little late to get into it, but just one of the uh, benefits that the Cadre provides is ongoing original bingo games. You were too very manly. So that's it, that's it. I mean, it's not just, the shaving cadre is not just shaving. We got bingo. There's a whole thread about, show us the snacks that you're having. On the next Drinks and Dave show in two days is gonna be our official, our official deep breakdown analysis of everything that was Super Bowl. Other than being there. I mean, I don't know that we're too far away of actually, you know, being invited by one of the one of the big networks to give real time real time commentary. I guess we should, we should Dave, we should have done that. We could do we could do streaming of our show all through the game, and people be like, "Whoop ha! That's awesome!" So is. Own Bray Barbershop, the sweetest smelling barbershop in Tucson. <sighs> Ooh, I'm already tired. Is it halftime yet? Man, I got I got comments about halftime, but now that uh, we're going to be discussing the Super Bowl on our show, I better curtail that. I better save my opinions. I got the the. <clears throat> CBL's goodness aftershave. What is this? Milk aftershave milk? Because there's muscle milk, right? That's a that's a super protein workout. That's the stupidest name. Muscle milk. Whatever. What are you, little baby? Mm. See, I would I would have my my guy on the side. They squirt. They squirt. Uh, you know, Gatorade or whatever in their mouths and stuff. I'd have some of this on the sideline. I'd take my helmet off and they'd pow, 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 pow. I'd be ready to get back in there. And then we're going to finish up, of course, with Flores Isla, which is going to finish you off with that, mmm, that beautiful smoky Isla Scotch scent. Boom. In and out. There we go. Go Niners. See you on the forum.